Because I'm running, I'm running. The Medford School District is feeling some growing pains. With elementary schools getting crowded, space needs to be made. Um, starting in July, we were like, okay, we need to find a place for Central, possibly for the district offices, and that's when we, we, we started to look, and that, that search really picked up steam in the fall. The district needs to find a location for the alternative school that would meet the needs of its nearly 250 students. Fortunately, in December, Cobblestone Village went up for sale. We're just excited to be really in a central location because Central Medford High School serves both kids who have come from the north side of town and kids who come from the south side of town. Um, and the space is ideal. When the opportunity presented itself, it was almost too good of a chance for the Medford School District to pass up. With so much space, nearly 35,000 square feet of it, the possibilities are endless. Imagine classrooms up here or areas of higher education happening right over here. Essentially, sky's the limit. I'm really excited to uh, be able to look at our new property and design it to really meet all of our programs and all the needs of our students. The school board approved the purchase Thursday for some $3.5 million. Plans are to renovate and build on top of the pre-existing structures. While the new Central High School will be found here at Cobblestone Village, you may be asking yourself what will happen with the old space? Well, the district says it's time to turn the page to a new chapter that will open up a third middle school here on Oakdale Avenue. By adding a middle school, moving sixth graders into middle school because they're currently at the elementary schools, we're going to open up several classrooms at each of our elementary schools. However, the deal isn't finished. The district is currently in a due diligence period. It also wants to be respectful to the businesses still on the property. But the plan is to close the deal in March and begin work by summer. In Medford, Miles Wodwichi, NBC5 News.